She never wakes up on the wrong side of the bed. I am Wendy at Odd Man Inn, and this is Grace's Story for Geo. We're a nonprofit farm animal sanctuary in Jamestown, Tennessee. The way we came across Grace was she was part of a small time breeding operation. When she needed vet care, they put her online as free pig will be good enough for dog food. That's just a heartbreaking way to describe such a beautiful animal. We took custody of Grace and we brought her into Oregon State University where they gave her the care that she needed. She has now lived as a happy, healthy resident of Odd Man Inn for the last five years. She's over 600 pounds, full grown, beautiful girl. She didn't have a name when we took her in. We immediately gave her the name Grace, a classic, gorgeous name. She's like a 1950s pinup girl. She has these really pretty eyes that I swear see right through you. <laughs> Grace's personality is big. It's really big. She is like the girl in high school who would have been prom queen. I swear when she talks to me with her low, grunty, excited voice, it's like she's telling me all the gossip of the entire sanctuary. She wants to tell me who's sleeping with who and who did who wrong. <laughs> hello, hello. We're on 93 acres in rural Tennessee, currently home to nearly 200 animal residents. Oh, yeah. And 180 of those are mostly large breed pigs. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Pigs are master problem solvers, and they seem to really understand complicated concepts and troubleshoot difficult scenarios, unlike any other species that I've seen. Watch, watch. And it's part of why running a pig sanctuary with 180 pigs is so challenging, because we're outnumbered 180 to there are five of us who run the sanctuary. <laughs> Grace has a whole pig family, a whole herd that she chooses to hang out with. You love your boyfriend. Oliver is, that's her man partner. Handsome. He's a big old guy, he's 10 years old. That's who she chooses to snuggle with at the end of the day. She is a 650 pound Hereford pig. The majority of her species are used in animal production and they don't get the opportunity to be seen for the gentle, beautiful creatures that they are. Hi, I love you. It feels like a noble cause to help these animals be seen for the really magical creatures that they are. I don't have favorites, but I do have a special bond with Grace. She is now a patient at the University of Tennessee intermittently where they check on her progress and make sure that everything looks okay. She doesn't even need sedation to be handled or examined. She lays down for a belly rub and she's perfectly happy to let the medical team examine her. We're just grateful for every day that we get to spend with her. I tell her every day, I could not possibly love you anymore if you were my child or my sister. I wish that she would live forever. Mm -hmm.